again a voice over. Oh, you in my ear. Uh-uh, you in my ear. Yeah, they won't hear. They won't hear.
Hey y'all, I'm Ace. Let's say grace so we can feed our face. Ooh. Hey y'all. If you're new to the crew, thanks for coming through. If you've been here before, then you know. Ooh. Then you know what's in store. Thanks for coming back. I guess it's gonna be another focus on the food video because it's got this spaghetti in focus. Not spaghetti, lasagna. I made lasagna. I've been wanting some lasagna. It's actually my favorite food, but I never make it. I'm trying it with pepperonis, and I cooked it like the million dollar spaghetti. So there is Alfredo sauce in here, ground beef, peppers, onions, everything. Even ricotta, and I don't like ricotta. And I got a piece of garlic bread. Let's eat. The kids, well, the girls eating it and they said it's good i forgot to get mozzarella cheese so it only has um cheddar cheese in it but it'll eat it'll eat if i can pick it up y'all doing how y'all been oh welcome to candace's corner <laughs> and welcome back to candace's corner y'all want bite it's delicious I kiss or dismiss family and friends edition collab drop today. So when y'all see this, if y'all ain't seen that, go watch it. stay together <laughs> I feel like I built it backwards but it'll be, I showed y'all in the beginning me making it <clears throat> and the cheese just coming off they, they went y'all can talk they went dead silent <laughs> Mm. <laughs> we in the corner. What is that in the corner? Real life. Can I take a more frosty? Mm-hmm. Y'all went to McDonald's today, right? That's good. The um, it was free Friday, no purchase necessary. We just had to order within the mobile app, right? So I took the kids. And I let them play for a little bit too. Um. So this older couple comes in with their grandchildren, right? And of course, y'all know McDonald's done upgraded where you place your order at the kiosk by yourself. Everything is self-service. So being that they were an older couple, he couldn't figure out how to work the machine, right? So I offered to do it for him. Mm. And the grandkids are maybe five to seven years old, max. So they didn't really know how to do it either. 
Anyway, I helped them. Now, they ordered two burgers of what's sometimes called a McFlurry and two cones, right? Two vanilla cones. Being that they're kids, they might not eat a lot, so I was like, you know, a burger, fill them up, and a little treat, right? It was like almost four. I get our food, well, Addie take our food to the table. They come back there with their food, right? The little boy is smashing that burger, tan it up, okay? And he goes to reach for his McFlurry. <laughs> anyway, his granddaddy was like, no, 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 no. Give me the cup. You can't have, they didn't have snack size available. So he got a full size one. You got to eat supper. Your mom's going to be mad at you when you get home. Because you're not going to eat supper. Well, what was this? Why you bring kids to McDonald's and think they're not going to ask for nothing to eat? At least a fry? What time he eat supper? It's already at almost 4 o'clock. Do we eat at 10? So he'll be hungry again? I'm so confused. How you going to buy it for him? Then fuss at him and say he can't have it so he can eat his dinner. I thought this was his dinner. I don't know. But he was pushing that cup so far away so his granddaddy couldn't reach it. He kept pushing it. And the granddaddy couldn't reach but so far he kept going. I was like, look at him. I was confused that how he gonna fuss at him? So you brought me here. You're the adult. <laughs> uh -uh. He got half of it though. And he still ain't gonna want to eat. If they eat like five o'clock, the way he would turn that food up. But then he let the daughter have her whole ice cream cone with his granddaughter. So, mmm, I see that. Oh, sir, you said you didn't want that Slurpee. It won't good. Why are you drinking it? And you chose cook cookies. Okay, put it down. Mm -hmm. Sneaky. Y'all know who it is. Look at him. Look here. So I figured out where he got these nuts from. Y'all know Mr. Beast on YouTube? He has a candy bar called These Nuts. And they watch Mr. Beast. So. That's where he got it from. But I feel like that's so inappropriate. Although it's candy. Okay. Well, them children gonna get in trouble in school saying that over a piece of candy. And a guy just told me that today. When I was seeing the candy bar, I was like, oh my God, that's where my son got it from. He was like, yeah, I'm a second grade teacher. And my students will bring the bar to me and say, what, what kind of candy is this? Read what this say. Granted, he seemed like he cool. He said he laughed about it, but all teachers ain't gonna be like that. Somebody's gonna get in trouble because of that. That was good. 
I can't show y'all what it looked like in the pan because the presentation is gone. But I showed y'all in the beginning. It's probably going to be my thumbnail. That was good. Very, very good. That Alfredo, I don't know. It just seemed like it go with it. Wow. That's it. That's all, y'all. Just a quick little video. I had to eat dinner, and I wanted to finally make this lasagna. I said I'm gonna come share with my friends. It is 7:20. Um, what I gotta do? Wash a few dishes, and I think that's it. I'm going to put my feet up and book our Airbnb. I was watching Be Love and Walk earlier. Did y'all know there's a show called? Seeking, let me look it up, because I was mind blown. Seeking brother husband. So instead of sister wives, this is a woman, or several women. One woman has two husbands that I've seen so far, and one is looking for a husband. And I'm assuming the one with two is looking for a third. I don't know yet, but... It's called Seeking Brother Husband on TLC. I'm watching it on Philo. So if you got Philo, it's on there. Y'all tune in so we can talk about it. Because I can't believe it. I know it's a thing. And I know people be like, oh, well, it's okay if a man do it type stuff. But I ain't on none of that. That's your business. It ain't mine. They ain't finna be t Never mind. <laughs> No. Not finna play with me. No. Mm -mm. Too many. Too many in the same house. Too many. I don't see. Mm -mm. I guess I'm gonna find out. Because I'm about to go binge watch that. So, by the time y'all see this, I might be pretty well done. Pretty much done with it. And we can talk about it. I need to make a community post so y'all can catch up. And by the time I'm done, we'll be done together. Um, I am so interested. Because men don't like to share. But apparently some do. So... Y'all look it up. And we're gonna talk about it. I can't wait. I'm trying to eat low chicken. I just made her some chicken for dinner tonight. Don't look good. Right. Right. I know. But I made it for him so he has some food for lunch. He done ate some of it. Alright. I'm gone. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. If you like and hit that post notification bell so you know when it's time for me to show up. Whether it be over the table or right here. Ow. Thank you. In Candace's Corner. But it's seeking brother husband. Catch up so we can chat. Later. <laughs>